Here's a question I get from time to time, and it's uh, pretty easy to answer. It might be more for you new users, but um, it's it's good one to know. Uh, if you're going to distort something, this is just lettering in here. You're going to go to the Effects menu and choose Distort, and then that's going to give you a preview. And if you click this big button, that gives you all the distortions that are available. A couple of things. You can click on the distortion you want, and in this case, like this is the question I get. is like, I want that arc to be on the bottom. I want the top of the letters flat and the bottom to be arced. Well, if you look at Design Central, you'll see some buttons over here. These actually control the handles that are used for the distortion. So if I come down here and to this bottom left-hand corner and click that, you'll see it flips those handles to the bottom. Then I can actually move these. And you notice also another tip here, if I move these back and forth, it's distorting the uh, lettering and kind of uh, creating an angle to it. But if I bring these in until that I'm using the T as kind of a reference here, uh, and I just have this T lined up like that. That's, you know, the it looks like the normal T flat on top, but an arc on the bottom. Now I click that check mark, and sure enough, I've got my distortion. And don't forget, because it's flexi, uh, it's still text. So if you highlight this, you know, and just type in uh, things like, there's my new word it'll just reapply that distortion to it. So it's kind of a great tip. I, I think you'll uh, appreciate using that. And uh, also keep in mind that even though this is distorted, you can go back and actually apply a second distortion to it if you want. So you're not limited to just one distortion. You can actually apply as many as you want to this lettering in here and get some really interesting effects out of it. So apply one distortion on the other. That's a great tip. Hope you enjoyed it. I invite you to join us at addendo.com where you'll find industry experts that can help you with detailed training. You can join an online community and discuss Flexi with other users as well as get expert help. Take an online course and learn at your own pace or get the advice of an expert through virtual training or even on-site training. Find out more today at www.addendo.com dot com